can regain we killed the armor in Fort Homer. So that's good. Uh, I think this war is going well. Even though the See what it will look like later on. Okay, McClendenburg is now our ally, so let's try to better our relationship. Yeah, we ask for military access. Okay, and we're sieging the whatever we call the mountains here. North near Finland. We're not lucky enough. And Denmark is offering us white peace, that means that they're getting into trouble. Still won't accept any offer, but that doesn't mean it won't change. Okay, we got land technology advance. And at the next level we will be able to build the weapons manufacturing. We can now raise uh, our stability investment again. Uh, Rupin has the highest revolt is called 14.2. Dienenberg accept uh, offers us peace. And they're right here. Why didn't I just go and kill them? Maybe we could force force the religion on them. Okay, we can it's having the Oh god our air force ill. Okay and he survived. It's great. And we're going to siege Lunenburg now. And the revolt and repent, but we're gonna take care of that. Okay, Lunenburg is ours. So it's demand tribute, concede defeat, force religion, force religion. Force of Legion, Renowned and Claims, Force of Civilization. What does it look like with our infamy? It's, it's raping us really bad. But if we get them to uh, vassalize we could annex them later on that would be really helpful that would be real helpful okay let's check what they can give us uh, else okay are they valuable Nah, they're, they're not that valuable. But they have um, salt. They have salt. Now let's just force religion and uh, make them renounce their claim. Nah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for it and make them Okay, and they accepted, and our infamy is now 18.6, yay! God.
Okay, we now got whatever is it called, Ingo something, and Swedish king has died. So let's see what this is gonna make it. Okay, we raped the army in Rupin. Are we at war with France? We're at war with France? How's that possible? When did this happen? Okay. I'm gonna change one thing. And French army is sieging Fort Pullman. It's really terrible. There's an arm, another army coming, so I hope this won't be one of those really bad situations. Okay, there are 17 of them right now. So I guess this counts as really bad. So let's move our army back to Brandenburg. Getting really bad uh, position. We're losing 1.7 regiment each each uh, week. And Hansa is sieging us as well. That's just great. So let's get rid of the Han Hanseatic army first. Okay, now I wish I accepted the peace from uh, from Denmark when they offered it. But too late for that, dude. And there are 23,000 men now in Fort Pomern. Yeah, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, but luckily our armies are coming home. So we may be able to face them. Why is it that every war I get involved in turns this terrible in the end? Do I, am I doing something wrong? Am I just... I don't know. Okay, and they're sieging for Pomer, and they, of course, they got it. So the army is now moving to Shtiti. They're gonna arrive on 22nd of November. We're gonna arrive on 19th of November. Okay, let's hope we will win this battle, otherwise we're really screwed. And yeah, we're, we're not winning. So let's get out of here. Left the battle because this is really not going well. And we're gonna siege for Pomern. We got the cannons, so let's try them. And they would not accept white peace. What a surprise!